Ohio is arrested, accused of forcing a woman into prostitution. West News Matt Grant has poured over the documents and is live in South Orange County. And Matt, you're at the house where NBI agents say the operation was being run. Oh, that's right, at the house right behind me. And according to documents, the trio bragged about their operation while the victim feared she'd be tortured and even killed. It's sad because this street always quiet. Too scared to show her face, this neighbor says she was stunned when she saw police raiding this home. It was just a whole bunch of police outside. Looked like they busting the doors because they just looked like they had garbage bags over top of the windows. Other neighbors also noticing black garbage bags obstructing the view inside this Flagler Drive home, telling us they saw cars coming and going late at night. Now abandoned, police say it was here where a woman was held captive, forced into prostitution last September. 31 year old Rodney Alexander, 26 year old Tiffany Belazare, and 43 year old Jose Alvarez now under arrest, accused of human trafficking after a months long investigation. Immediately, they took advantage of her addiction to cocaine and uh, started posting her on Backpage and forcing her to uh, prostitute. Lieutenant Mike Gibson with the Metropolitan Bureau of Investigation says the three suspects preyed on the victim's addiction to crack cocaine, supplying her with drugs and using violent threats to keep her under control. In fact, it got so bad at one point that they actually tied her up with sheets and dog collars and dog chains, leashes, and, and held her captive inside closets. According to documents, the victim was forced to prostitute every day, walking the streets and responding to online ads posted on Backpage.com. She says the ringleader, Alexander, punched her and threatened to torture her with power tools and a curling iron on days she only made $50. She escaped last October. And all three right now are behind bars at the Orange County Jail. Alexander, the accused ringleader, is on no bond. The other two are on a $100,000 bond. All three faces charges right now of human trafficking. Live in Orange County, Matt Grant, West 2 News on CW18.